morning from Lettuce Heat. I have my uncooked chicken in my crock pot. It's seasoned with fresh black cracked pepper and garlic. I was going to do chicken tacos today, but because it's raining with ice outside today, and it's going to turn into snow later, probably up to four inches in my area, I thought a nice big pot of chicken taco soup was in order. Now I just put my water in, but I'm going to add a little more. So about a cup of water total is in the crock pot with the chicken. I'm going to cover the crock pot and I'll be right back. Okay, now that I switched the phone around, I had the crock pot going. I'm going to start adding my ingredients. I'm going to start off with a 14.5 ounce can of diced tomato. Careful taking off the lid, they can be very sharp. Dump that right into my crock pot. This is a dump and go recipe. I'm going to add in my boiling cube. I'm going to peel my onion. I peel the onion, I slit it a little, it makes it peel easier, and I keep my colander in my sink as a garbage bowl for easier cleanup. I cut the onion in half. Careful not to cut yourself. I'm going to give my hands a quick rinse. If you rub your hands on your stainless, it'll help take the sting away from your eyes so you don't cry. Since this is chicken taco soup, I'm going to add a can of uh, super sweet corn. This is about 15 ounces. Corn is sitting in a can for a very long time, so I'm going to dump this into my other colander, in my other side of my sink. I'm going to give them a quick rinse. I'm 
while that's rinsing, I have my taco kit. Take the shells out for later because I'm going to put them to the top, on top of my soup like a crouton. I'm going to save my soft shells for breakfast sandwiches. And I'm going to add the seasoning mix and the salsa mix. I'm going to put this into the crock pot. I'm going to add the salsa into the crock pot. Give my hands a quick rinse. Now the corn has been rinsing for about a minute, so I'm going to put it into the crock pot. I got some frozen peppers and onions. That's why I only used a half an onion. I want to put some bell peppers in it because you generally, when you do tacos at home, I always add bell peppers to my tacos and enchiladas. I'm new to all the angling. I'm going to learn how to use the video part on my Nikon DLSR that I have. With the zooming and everything, what's best for uh, videography. Now I'm going to add some garlic salt. About two tablespoons. I'm going to add in my fresh black cracked pepper. And I think I'm going to add in about a quarter of a cup more water. I'm going to give it a nice big stir. Now it may not look like a lot of chicken, but my um, youngest won't eat it. And I don't think my teenager will, so it's just for me and my husband. And then we'll freeze some for our lunches the next week of what's left over. For dinner for them, they'll probably have some macaroni and cheese or breakfast for dinner, which is real popular for them. This is what the soup looks like once everything is in the crock pot. I put in the pound of raw chicken cutlets, a quarter cup of frozen peppers and onions, a half a minced onion, a 14 ounce can of diced tomato, a 15 ounce can of rinsed corn. I put in two tablespoons of fresh black cracked pepper, two tablespoons of gran granulated garlic. I put in one seasoning packet for tacos mixed tacos. And I put in some salsa from the taco kit as well. This is what's for dinner tonight, chicken taco soup. I'm going to top it with sour cream, if I have it, cheese, and my hard taco shells that I set aside.
My husband will probably just have his with some hard taco shells. Tomorrow I'm going to try to do the BJ's haul, weather permitting. We have a big snowstorm coming away. Right now it's sleeting and raining outside. And the kids are at school. They'll be home around 3. So I hope that they might try it. I hope they do. If they do, I'll take pictures. If you like my video, please give it a like. If you would like to see more cooking videos or my BJ's haul, please ring the notification bell and subscribe. And thank you for always watching Let Us Eat.